Trump may not be an heir to Trump fortune after all. Tiffany Trump is the only child from Donald Trump's second marriage to Martha Maples, and she hasn't been as close to her father as her half-sister and two half-brothers have been through the years. This might be why she referred to at times as the other Trump, as the New Times referred to Tiffany last year in an article. Once Donald Trump hit the campaign trail, Tiffany was expected to play a larger role in Trump's political life and the New York Times describes her as the B-list Trump who was off to the side in family photos and missing from the campaign trail. She was even left out of the documentary that Trump showed at the Republican National Convention. Blasting News is reporting today that Tiffany Trump might not end up as lucky as the other famous Trump siblings when it comes time to read the Trump will someday in the future. Back in 2005 when Melania Trump was pregnant with Barron, Donald Trump's two oldest children, Ivanka and Donald, Jr., suggested he take Tiffany out of the will, as another child was coming. Apparently, this stems from what was said in the numerous Howard Stern tapes from Trump's appearances on several of his shows over the decades. Trump reportedly told Stern that his two oldest children, Ivanka and Donald, Jr., once advocated to put Tiffany out of the will reports People magazine. According to Blasting News, when Melania was pregnant with Barron, Ivanka and her brothers were already upset about having a sister, Tiffany, who they would need to split the inheritance with one day. Apparently, this is the foundation for advocating writing their half-sister out. People magazine quoted the source saying that Tiffany has no promises when it comes to an inheritance from Donald Trump. She is not guaranteed anything which is one of the reasons Tiffany and Marlo have been so respectful of her dad and tiptoed around so much, the source also said. The recording of Trump and Stern talking in 2005 during a segment of Stern's show apparently revealed this buzz about Tiffany and the will. Trump opened up to Stern how his two oldest kids advocated for Tiffany to be written out of the will, or bump Tiffany from the inheritance. Tiffany has grown close to Ivanka as she got older and she asked for her big sister's help when approaching their father so she could have some money as a teen. Although Trump paid for Tiffany's education and her housing needs, that was it. She doesn't get an allowance. She once asked Ivanka to give her some pointers for talking to their father so she could ask for some extra monetary help. Back in February, Vanity Fair published an article where Ivanka tells the story about Tiffany needing money for the necessities in life when she was 15 years old. Ivanka, Donald, Jr., and Eric Trump lived with their mother in Trump's hour. They were just an elevator ride from their father's apartment, but Tiffany lived on the other side of the country. Because of the distance, she didn't become as close to her dad as her older siblings had. According to Vanity Fair, Ivanka talks about Tiffany asking for her help in approaching their father for a parental credit card, like her friends all had. Ivanka said she was proud of her sister, who wasn't asking out of greed. She wanted to fit in with her friends. Tiffany just wanted advice from her sister on how to approach their dad with this request and she even practiced her approach, but it was all for nothing. Ivanka talked to their father and he agreed to the credit card for Tiffany. They surprised her with it at Christmas. This was a few years after the 2005 tapes where Trump supposedly divulged that Ivanka was one of his two children advocating to pull Tiffany out of the will. If these stories are correct, it would appear Ivanka had a change of heart about her little sister Tiff, as she'd known to those close to her. Trump and Martha Maples divorced in 1999 when Tiffany was very young. She has never lived a life of luxury or even that of a rich girl since her parents' divorce, according to People magazine. Other than her education being covered by her father, she didn't have any special privileges, like having a Trump family credit card, that is until Ivanka went to bat for her.